affiliate marketing for beginners. This is my free traffic plan that has made over $517,000. So I'm gonna skip my normal intro uh, today and get straight into the meat and potatoes. It's why things look a little different on this video, but I wanted to start out and let you know that my goal with this channel is to produce weekly videos to provide good, valuable content to help you make money online. So be sure and subscribe to the channel so that you're notified every time I make a new video. Now, let's jump straight into it. And and really, there is no Staples Easy button. Uh, I mean, there is for $9.29 here, but there's no Staples Easy button for making money online. But this method is about as close to doing that as uh, I've ever seen. This comes from a buddy of mine who, and I'll pull up this earnings report. Uh, he just sent me the screenshot and he shared this with me um, just a little while ago, about a month ago. Um, but I want to just kind of gets fuzzy when I blow it up. But he made over five hundred and seventeen thousand dollars since two thousand seven doing things exactly like this. So I'm going to dive in and start to show you right now. Okay, so we're over here at the computer, and I wanted to take a quick second because. I know the title of this video is Affiliate Marketing for Beginners, and you might be saying, what's cost per action? What's CPA marketing? So real quick, a boiled down version is CPA marketing or CPL marketing. Uh, they're all forms. They're all really forms of affiliate marketing. So all of the affiliate marketing that I've been talking about to this point uh, in the previous videos is really driving traffic to an offer, somebody else's offer where they make a sale and you get paid on the sale. CPA is really cost per acquisition, and that is just for a lead. Really, we're trying to now just provide, be a lead provider for this seller. So that's the real difference. Yes, there are more technical differences and nuances and things like that, but for all intents and purposes, this is really what we're looking at doing. And just like I said earlier, the example of my buddy that did $517,000 in CPA marketing on one offer since 2007, uh, he told me about this, I don't know, a month ago and said he was doing it with really good success. And so I just wanted to shoot a video to bring it to you to show you how you can drive that free traffic to a CPA offer and get residual passive income coming to you. So with no further ado, I want to jump over to this website called Skillshare. Now, Skillshare is one of many other websites like Udemy, uh, et cetera, that there are people that put together courses on how to do something um, without even clicking around the website. Uh, Fundamentals of DSLR photography. I could take a course to find out how to use a DSLR camera. Here's uh, creating word mats. Here's essays, how to write essays, top 10 tricks and uh, tips and tricks to speed up your workflow. All of these are paid courses. Uh, that people are going to teach you how to do something and Skillshare will pay us a set amount of money every time we just bring them even a lead it doesn't have to uh, buy into their premium membership just a lead so let's uh, scroll to the bottom of Skillshare consequently you can do this with any number of those other websites too um, I'm just using Skillshare as an example but if you scroll to the bottom and come to their affiliate page um, what's really, really nice about this, two things that I really like is uh, they have a 30-day cookie, which is a long amount of time. Somebody you can drive traffic to their website, to a particular course that might interest them. And if they don't like it, maybe there's another similar course that they might then sign up for, maybe a day or two, a week, couple weeks, 30 days later, it doesn't matter. Um, whereas, let's say like an Amazon affiliate uh, associates uh, program there is a 24-hour cookie so this has a 30-day cookie which is awesome and the other nice thing is that it says affiliates earn commission for each new customer that signs up as a premium membership obviously a paid membership or we get paid if they sign up for a free trial and they pay up to ten dollars I think we're probably gonna have to hit a tier to to reach that but if we click on the join for free it kind of gives you a little bit of a breakdown. I think right now as a starting out affiliate or a marketer, uh, what they're offering is $7. The referral period is 30 days. So you can kind of see here, you know, if we had 10 conversions, 70 bucks, they're doing the math for us. This is on a daily basis and that would be $2,100 a month. So, you know, you can start to see how if you can just drive traffic to people to sign up for a free trial 30 day membership, we're not asking them to do anything, not pay any money, and we can get paid uh, as a reward for it. So 
how does he, how does my buddy, or how do we drive free traffic to this offer? So what's really, really nice is, and I'll come back uh, to the front side of the website. Let's see if I can come up here. And we'll go to uh, one of the categories like photo and film. Uh, here's fundamentals of photo editing. Here's video editing with Adobe Premiere. Cool. Maybe I'll look at that. It's what I use to edit these videos with. So here are some classes uh, that are very popular. And what we do is if we come over to a website like Quora, right? Let me, uh, let me go to the homepage here. If we go to a website like Quora, we can do a search for, uh, what was that? Uh, Photography, Premiere Pro. So let's see if we do a search for Photoshop. And what's the best way to learn Photoshop? Here's a great one. There are 332 people that are following this post, this question answer post. So if we go into this question answer post, you can see that uh, here's somebody uh, they want to get. Here's my learning process. I started at home more than a decade ago, blah, blah, blah. Um, so we can come down here and we can answer. We can either uh, add a comment to somebody's answer or post, or we can just answer it ourselves. We can click on answer. We can say, uh, and I won't type a big long post here, but you'll get the gist of it. Um, you, uh, I just see here that Mark works at Reach Local. I used to, but uh, not anymore. Anyways, so we can write an answer like, uh, you know, uh, I have uh, taken courses on Skillshare for photography, and there was one in particular that really, the instructor really taught me in a great way, blah, blah, blah. And by the way, I just signed up for their 30-day free trial, so I got to try and uh, go through the course at no cost. And here's a link to the course that I took. We are just trying to provide value and answer people's questions. Um, and Quora is just one of many uh, of these types of forums that we could post answers to. Facebook groups on photography and all sorts of things. You don't want to come off looking like you're trying to hard sell somebody on something. You just want to be there and provide value. And you're sending a link. Uh, over to uh, the Skillshare site that will be a, a direct link on one of the classes, let's say uh, like this class. Uh, when you sign up for the Skillshare affiliate program, obviously you will get uh, an affiliate link. So you'll use that. You can use like a, a Bitly or a Google Shortener or something that uh, makes the, the answer look a little bit better. Um, but that's what's really, really nice about this is if you do it through a Facebook group forum. There are so many people that you can reach. This reaches 332 people. If we come back over here, where can I find good tutorials about photo editing with Photoshop? There are 514 people you could reach just like that by writing an answer in there. So that's 819 people. Uh, you know, you, here's one Photoshop to 900 people. It's something else, but you can do all sorts of searches on, let's say Quora and find all types of groups. Now, if you're reaching this many people, all those people are going to be notified when you uh, write an answer to that post. You can find a different topic, a different subject on Skillshare, find it on Quora and post it. The nice thing about this is that it's perpetual. It's kind of an evergreen type of program. So if you can set aside some time in the day to go through this every day and find and set up maybe five or 10 new uh, posts and affiliate links, you know, sky's the limit. This is passive residual income that will just be coming your way. And it, it really only increases over time. You know, like I said, these are evergreen. So more and more people are going to be coming to Quora and more and more people are going to read uh, these types of posts and read your answer. And if people are liking it and they upvote it, then it gets bumped to the top. So there are a lot of ways or, or topics, just really an endless amount of topics that you could do this on. And just for a little stat, Quora now has as many active users as Pinterest. They have over 300 million active users on Quora. So it's not some small time little place, but like I said, not only is your, the amount of different subjects almost endless on Skillshare uh, and you can put them on Quora, but you can put them on Facebook groups. You can put them on so many other different groups and these things add up over time. And before you know it, you could be making an extra hundred dollars a day, $200 a day, $300 a day, just using this technique. So 
if you found the video useful, then give me a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel so that you'll be notified every time I put out a new video. And now we'll see you on the next video. Be sure to subscribe to the channel to be notified of future videos. And don't forget to like this video. Now watch that video next. Go ahead, watch that video.